Hey guys, my name's Taylor. Today I'm going to be showing you how to turn this picture right here, which is just crazy good. I love the photography, I love the editing, the composition, it's all just really nice. Into this picture right here, which I think is more suited for like Instagram and stuff. My last video was an Instagram tutorial and I think that it was pretty good, so I'm going to make another one. It's using uh, very similar tools, so if you haven't seen that video, go and check that one out. Um, but I'm just gonna jump right into it. I'm gonna drag and import my photo and To get started. I'm just gonna unlock this background layer by clicking on the lock that automatically unlocks it We're gonna add an adjustment layer by clicking this half black half white circle and going to gradient map and by default It's set to black to white. We're gonna change this black to like a dark um, you know, you can do dark red, you can do dark blue. I found that dark purple looks pretty good on her, so I'm gonna go ahead and do the dark purple, and then we're gonna set the white to a light pink color. And this, I think, looks pretty good. Um, I've done this quite a few times for different pictures and stuff, and I think it looks good, but I think it looks even better if you lower the opacity a little bit and let some of the color shine through from the original picture. So look, original, and that's what we ended up with and I think there's a lot more that you can do to this picture you can add some light effects you can add some different uh, reflections and stuff you know her glasses are really reflecting the light I'm just gonna go ahead and add in a gradient like I did in the last video and set this to white just kind of mess around with where this is located maybe right there drag it off a little bit it's a little too harsh Press OK, set this to screen. I think that looks pretty good, but I think it'd look even better if it was under the gradient map. Yep, I was right. So maybe, maybe set this to 50, 45%, and then we're gonna go ahead and do Control J and drag that gradient fill up above. So you're getting a little bit of white, a little bit of purple, yeah, I think that looks really cool. So just to kind of show you guys how easy it is to apply an effect, I'm gonna go ahead and drag in a different picture altogether. And as you can see, this picture is completely different. You know, this one's a lot darker, it's a lot more moody, um, but just dragging this under what we did earlier, and I'm actually gonna get rid of that, uh, that white gradient layer. Look how good that looks already. You know, we can change this, maybe um, make it like a turquoise to a light orange color. I think that looks really cool, actually. You know, just, just dragging it in and changing the colors, it took me, what, 10 seconds, maybe? I think this is a really cool effect. I think you guys can do a lot with this. If you liked this video, make sure you click the links on the screen right now, and I will see you in the next video.